Hey guys, I'm Rashi Himalia and today I have for you 11 swatches of Makeup Forever lipsticks. These are brand new. We're going to get into this right now. This is the shade Bold Cinnamon. This is a little bit too light for my pigmented lips. It's a gorgeous peach shade but I don't think this works for me. I can absolutely make this work with a lip liner but on its own it's a little bit too light. This is the shade Fearless Valentine, a perfect nude for me. This is a gorgeous warm brown. Yes, I love this one. This is a beautiful nude. This is Poised Rosewood, a gorgeous, kind of like a, a light mauve pink. It's very pretty. This will also be a really nice pinky nude. See rhubarb, another gorgeous pink. This one is more of a brighter cousin of poised rosewood. It's really pretty. I love this one. This is upbeat mauve. Definitely a deeper pink, more on the mauvish berry side. This is a gorgeous pumpkin shade. It's called Subtle Cider. This is the shade Stylish Lychee. I do prefer the Subtle Cider over this one. It's a coral that I don't think particularly looks nice on my skin tone, but with a lip liner, I think this would look great. But on its own, Mm. Now this is a fun lip color. This is called Dashing Plum and I don't think this is plum. This is more of a lilac shade. This is very bright. This is called Glowing Ginger. Uh, bright orange. I'm not sure how I feel about this one, but I do think it's very pretty. I think I like it. This is the shade Crafted Wine. It's beautiful and I love how the shade looks with the look that I've got going on. It's a gorgeous deep red. This is called Cherry Chili. This is a beautiful deeper berry. It's called Cherry Chili, but I don't see too much red in this. I see more berry tones. And this is what this looks like. I love how these lipsticks apply so smoothly. Even these deeper, darker shades, they didn't apply patchy at all. They were extremely smooth to apply. And you know what? I've just done 11 swatches of these lipsticks and my lips still feel comfortable. They don't at all feel like I need to get this off my face, which often happens with lip swatches and when you're trying so many lipsticks. I have worn these for a full day and what I can tell you is that they last a decent amount of time. You will need to reapply if you're eating and just like a standard lipstick, I think the wear time is pretty average and you're going to have to reapply pretty much like a normal standard Lipstick. Now the finish of these is interesting. They're a mix between a satin and a matte. So it's not fully matte, but it's not fully satin either. It's a nice hybrid. Also, when I had these on, they didn't dry out my lips at all. I was able to wear these quite comfortably through the whole day. I really like this formulation. The only downside, well, there are two downsides. One of them is the fact that 
it has a pretty strong scent. For those of you that are quite sensitive to scents, you may want to avoid these or at least just grab one to try out because the scent does linger on the lips a little bit. I'm going to say five to 10 minutes. Now the scent does go away, your nose gets used to it, but I know that one of you, hey Rachel, if you're watching, so Rachel, one of my subscribers, she got a headache from this lipstick because of that scent. Now for me, I didn't experience that. After about 10 minutes, the scent for me was pretty much gone and I did not experience any headaches with these lipsticks. The other thing is the packaging. So this is what the lipstick tube looks like. The standard lipstick and then it's got this really tall cover. And so the entire lipstick looks like this. It's quite big and unfortunately this is a bit of an issue when it comes to storage especially if you buy multiples of these you can store them like this but then they will topple if you try and store them in a lipstick case this is too big to fit in a lipstick case if you try and store them like this they'll just fall out because lipstick cases aren't exactly this tall so unfortunately the packaging is disappointing but other than that the lipsticks themselves are beautiful they are pigmented they're comfortable and of course these come in a huge selection of shades i saw 62 shades online that's ridiculously good thank you guys for watching and i'll catch you in my next video see ya